guys and welcome to today's video. Today is our first moving vlog. I am so excited yet also so sad. I am not ready to start packing up this place. I have been avoiding it for the past few days. If you guys don't know or you're new here, this is our first apartment that we moved into when we got married, which was just six months ago. I can't believe it's been six months. It feels like a long time, but also feels really short. And I am just not ready to leave this place. We love the location of our apartment. We are walkable to everything, coffee shops, restaurants, grocery stores, everything. And it's super sad, but we're not moving too far away, which is really nice. And I'm so happy to be having a backyard and have neighbors and things like that. I am happy and sad all at the same time. And I'm learning that that's okay. And that's normal. So I am going to start packing up. I've got three days to pack up this apartment. Sam is in the office today working, so he won't be here, but at night he's gonna help me and we're gonna slowly start migrating things to the house. And then this weekend, which will be like a separate vlog, a part two will actually help us move all the big furniture, like our bed, our TV stand, the dresser, all that stuff, the couch, into the house because we own a trailer so it's just really really easy but i'm gonna start packing things up and putting things in boxes and i'm really hoping to put a really big dent into things today it is a rainy gloomy day and so i feel like it might be a good mood to do that let's start i am like oh i've been avoiding this just because i'm really sad i mean i even have like my christmas decorations still up and i don't think i'm gonna put them back up in the new house because it would just be up for like a week, which would be pointless. Let's get started. I think I'm gonna kick it off in the bathroom with like under the sink and all of that stuff because we don't really need it. And before we get started into the video, if you guys don't follow me on Instagram, you definitely should. I've been giving you guys sneak peeks at the house over there and just like bring you along on my daily routine, which is a lot of fun. So definitely follow me over there. So with all that being said, let's get packing. I finished filling up these three boxes. I've got one over there by the window and that's really defeating because I'm like, I've only done three boxes, but I feel like I've been doing so much. But I'm gonna take a break, I'm gonna eat lunch and I'm also going to make some cookies because I'm about to pack up the kitchen. Um, I wanna make some for the leasing office downstairs just cause they're so nice. And then I also want to make some extra dough for whenever my family comes. I can just throw them in the oven really quick. So that's what I'm gonna do. And it's gonna be my last time making cookies in this apartment. It's so sad. I get like sentimental like that. Like I'm the kind of person that thinks those things. Like if I ever visit somewhere, I'm like, oh, this is the last time I'll be here. But I'm gonna enjoy the moment. I'm not gonna be sad in the moment. So I'm gonna quickly make some cookies. Even though this isn't moving content, you know I'm gonna put it in. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna take down the Christmas tree. I've been avoiding this project, but I'm just gonna do it. Thank goodness I saved all of like the things that the bulbs came in because I wouldn't know what to do. Because when I bought this stuff, we did not think we were moving. So we had no clue. So it was nice for the time being, but I'm gonna take it down and it's gonna be a project. tree 
three all put away and Sam is actually on his way back from the office right now and in his car we have like big clear tubs we've got like three and I bought them because I knew I'd want to put like our Christmas decorations in the basement of our house which you haven't seen our house yet so I just gave that away but <laughs> anyway but we have this area down there that's like we'll just use for storage so I'm gonna put all of that in that clear bin but I can't do that just yet so I think I'm gonna start tackling the kitchen I've been avoiding this I don't want to do this part just because like that makes me really sad but I think I need to do it I think I'm gonna start with like my baking stuff and just kind of organize everything and put away the dishes that we don't use very often the dishwasher is running right now and then by the time that's done I'll start putting like all the plates away and things like that really quick because he's about to start bringing boxes down I put a pretty big dent in things we're in a pretty big rush right now so. no why are you, like he's rushing me and it's stressing me out I'm like why are we rushing so I've got those two boxes filled with decorations these boxes this is like my tech box this one's empty um, and then all of these boxes as well and then I was in the middle of putting our glasses in here when I ran out of paper. And I emptied out all of these. That one up there, kind of crazy. Do you just have all this energy? We're in such a rush. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> so we're eating our leftover um, pasta cheesecake. from the Cheesecake Factory from last night. That is still so good. Yeah, mine is still really good too. Okay, so we just brought a ton of boxes down to the car. Hi. Yeah, that's actually. <laughs> <laughs> Sam just brought a ton of boxes down to the car, and we're about I'm to go. I'm humble, also. He actually is. That's just funny. We're about to take those to the new house, and so I'll pick up this vlog again tomorrow because you guys haven't seen the house yet, so I'm not going to show you anything. What? You're sad? You're mad that you can't see our house? Jealous of our eyes? We've seen it, you haven't? One day, people, <laughs> one day. Very soon, this week, you'll see it. Good morning, everybody. It is the next day, and I am here again, ready to start packing. Today's goal is to pack up the entire kitchen. I was in the middle of doing the glasses yesterday when I ran out of that paper, so we went and got more last night, a couple more boxes, and I'm really hoping to just finish all of that off. The only issue that I'm running into right now is that there are things in our fridge that are in like containers that I still need to clean and put away. So I don't know if I just throw those in a random thing like at the end whenever we officially move. I'm not really sure what to do with that, but I'm just gonna keep on moving along with the glasses and just kind of getting everything out of all of these cabinets.
It has been a hot minute since I picked up the camera. I just ran downstairs to go get a latte at the coffee shop in our apartment downstairs. I can say it now because we're not living here anymore, but I loved that we had that just right there. Um, and I've done a lot. I have almost fully packed up the kitchen. I just have the pantry and then the stuff on the counter that I need to pack up. I just took a break. I did emails. I edited some. I just feel like I'm going back and forth right now and I'm in the middle of like washing sheets and blankets and things like that just so they're clean um, whenever we get into the house. Yeah, I am tired, but I'm trying to keep on going because the goal is to have all this stuff done like as soon as possible. So yeah, I'm tired. Hopefully this coffee will kick in really soon so I can just keep on going. My back hurts from like bending so much and lifting heavy things and things like that. It has been a long time since I've talked to you guys. I have completely finished the kitchen. It is all empty except for the coffee pot, which we have to use. I do have the dishwasher running, which has some containers and stuff in there that I will eventually put in here. That has to go in the trash. And these are all the boxes that I've done today, which is crazy. So Sam is still working, but he should be home fairly soon. And in the meantime, I am going to go through my clothes in the dresser and kind of separate like what I'm going to need for the next few days and then put everything else in here just to make the dresser lighter whenever they carry it out. So my goal is to get most stuff out of here and put into this box. I know it's nothing new, but it's so good to see you. This every day, and I'm still so amazed by you. So hold me tight through the night. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's just a you scared me so bad. <laughs> I'm sorry. Alright guys, we pretty much loaded up as much as we could in the car. This is what's left. I say we, again, it was Sam. Okay, we are on our way. We got all the boxes in the car. So we don't know where we're gonna go get dinner, but that's the first thing we're doing because I've had hot Cheetos and salsa today. Great, healthy, healthy, healthy choices. I love a woman that just eats right. Yep, perfect. That's you. So we don't know where we're going, but we'll figure it out. Jacqueline, no. Oh. Got it. 